Dimitri and I um, take care of Area 10 um, project space in Peckham. We're holding the Scrap Club tonight um, and it's where people are allowed to come and um, smash, up, smash up household appliances. Wajid and Joel run the Scrap Club and I think you'll be speaking to them later about that. I think they're probably what you'd call contemporary deconstructivists or destructivists. This thing kick-started from when Joel and I were involved in the recreation of a really famous gig by Einstein and now about in 1984 was the original gig. What happened is that part of the ICA was destroyed, right? It turned into a riot. The whole gig is sort of mythologized, actually, you know. Uh, so there was destruction involved in that. And, uh, and we both came up with the idea, listen, why don't we swap this round? Why don't we, um, instead of an audience coming in and seeing this destructivist event, why don't we switch the solid around and actually give the power to people themselves, you know, and destroy it themselves. So, without further ado, John, thanks, please. Uh, Saiben Belardi. Who's Saiben? Okay, put the other uh, robbers on the bed. It's a massively cathartic event for people, right? But we've got to, you know, like the last time we did it, we had some injuries, right? So we've got to make sure everyone's pretty safe. Spatial awareness. Be a, the mind of a choreographer. Ready? a washing machine and I recommend using the big pole because it's really good you can swing but you can also jab and my first move was to stick it straight through the front of a washing machine it's very exciting you've got to come I like the when you get teamwork between people taking out bullying on one little bit of machinery. I think that's quite cool when you've got like three people just picking on like one one bit of telly, that's quite nice. See people come together in the destruction. Yeah, I love like just smashing stuff and taking turns to hear it's like Hello mate, I don't know you, but I'll smash this with you. <laughs> you have to distract things to make new things, and so it's like, it's the best stress reliever ever. <laughs> Is it art? Surely not. Oh, I don't know, maybe. It depends how you define art. Surely you could define art anyway. But, I don't know, it is just so much fun smashing all the shit up. In combination with just smashing it up, these are things that we use every single day and you wouldn't ever consider smashing in the microwave with a sledgehammer. <laughs> and so, to do so is, is a pretty um, sort of surreal experience. Ready? Ready? Look, you can see this humanity just zips through audiences, right? There's an elation that comes out to this, and lots of social norms just kind of vanish, right? 